The World Robot Conference 2023 has kicked off in China. This is truly one of the grandest events of this year in the field of robotics. Taking place in Beijing, the event is being held at the Etrong International Exhibition and Convention Center. As stated by the exhibition organizers, the main theme of the event is open innovation and collaborative future. More than 140 Chinese and foreign companies brought about 600 exhibits to the World Robot Expo. Among the machines showcased at the exhibition, there are realistic humanoid robots with synthetic skin, four-legged dogs, and hotel robots delivering food and drinks to customers. In this video, we will tell you about the most interesting novelties presented at the exhibition, as well as show you the latest technologies from the world of robotics. Let's get started. Guests of the event show a special interest in humanoid robots. One of the standout moments of the event was the animatronic heads and humanoid robots showcased at the X-Robots booth. They embody the image of what robots should be in the public imagination with synthetic skin and realistic facial expressions complemented by moving arms. CEO Lee Boyan stated that they are ideal for roles, requiring interaction with the public such as in museums, tourist attractions, schools, and companion scenarios. As Lee Boyan himself said, these robots are used in the service industry. One of our main technologies is flexible connections. The connection must be precise and small. It is challenging to fit dozens of moving parts into such a small space like a face. There are many hopes for humanoid robots. For instance, this android is great at making coffee. The product director of Dream Company, Li Yuan, said, This is just the first step. Next, we will train robots to become family life assistants, helping with household chores. In the future, we will also create robots that become operators in industrial production. Today, robots actively assist people both at work and at home. We can see robots in hospitals, restaurants, shopping centers, nursing homes, and factories. Even on farms, robots are already helping in the harvesting of fruits and vegetables. For example, this one can pick cherry tomatoes every three to six seconds. The product director of Dream Company, Zhu Lui, added, the first advantage of our robots is speed, and the second is accuracy. Additionally, the artificial intelligence algorithm allows our robot to assess whether the fruits meet the necessary collection requirements based on shape, color, and size. In another part of the conference hall, a single port surgical robot developed by Shirai is performing complex tasks, such as cleaning a quail egg, to demonstrate its high precision. Single port surgery is a procedure carried out through a single incision, which is already being used in hospitals around the world for various procedures, including kidney surgeries and cystectomies. Robotic surgery is gradually becoming more skillful, giving minimally invasive robotic procedures greater chances of success in the medical field. The single port laparoscopic surgical robot manufactured by Shirui mainly consists of two parts, the main console and the operating table. The doctor simply needs to sit in front of the main console and use two finger operated joysticks to remotely control the manipulator on the operating table to perform a series of tasks such as peeling, cutting, suturing, and other procedures when the joystick receives the doctor's actions and transmits them to the robotic surgical arm, artificial intelligence technology can also help filter out slight hand tremors, reduce bleeding and surgical damage, thereby enabling the operation to be conducted more stably and accurately, said one of the managers at China Science Daily. High-tech fairs also feature robotic dogs and among them is B1 by Unitree Robotics, a company based in Hangzhou, China. Previously, the company showcased incredible features of its robot dogs. Developers demonstrated that the robot can move underwater, with its body protected to an IP68 water resistance standard. Additionally, the Unitree B1 can lift loads weighing 80 kilograms or more. In a published video, the robot carries a person weighing over 100 kilograms. The robot is capable of moving at speeds of up to 1.8 meters per second, and one battery charge provides two to four hours of operation. It can move not only on a flat surfaces, but also on rough terrains. Overcoming stairs is also quite possible for the device. The robot is equipped with five cameras for monitoring its surroundings. It is planned that the Unitree B1 can be used to work in challenging conditions, such as rescue operations. Another robotic creation is depicted scoring a ball with a friend on a miniature court in the conference center. Robots engaging in sports are quickly becoming a popular industry and have even spawned their own world championships. Also appearing is Cyber One, a humanoid costing $104,000, developed by Xiaomi, which walks like a human. Cyber One is equipped with an artificial intelligence interaction algorithm that allows it to perceive three-dimensional space, as well as recognize people, gestures, and expressions. 
According to Xiaomi, the bot can recognize 85 different environmental sounds and 45 human emotions. Meanwhile, robotic flexible arms with numerous joints, which can be used in manufacturing, demonstrated their capabilities amid concerns about robots replacing humans. Among the Chinese population, there is growing concern about the use of technology in public roles that were previously performed by humans. In another part of the exhibition, a French artist robot in a beret and mustache sketches for the surrounding crowd. Xiaomi also introduced a number of new products at an event in China, including the CyberDog 2 Robot Dog. This innovation succeeds the previous CyberDog model, which was unveiled by the manufacturer in 2021. The new robot is smarter and more closely resembles a dog, weighing 8.9 kilograms and standing at a height of 36.7 centimeters. CyberDog 2 has the appearance of a Doberman breed. The robot is equipped with Xiaomi CyberGear patented microdrives, granting it high maneuverability and enabling it to perform complex tricks like continuous backflips. Moreover, it can autonomously get back on its feet in case of a fall and can move at a speed of up to 1.6 meters per second. CyberDog 2 uses a set of 19 sensors that provide it with vision, touch, and hearing capabilities. Thanks to these sensors, the robot moves in space with amazing accuracy. The manufacturer has placed significant emphasis on the robot's computational performance. Xiaomi has priced the CyberDog 2 at $1,789. In China, this new product is already available for order through the official manufacturer's website. Other machines presented at the exhibition were designed for the hospitality industry, aiming to replace human staff and potentially save establishment costs. For instance, children had the opportunity to take photos with a robot that was handing them ice cream cones, while another robot simultaneously served small cups of Chinese tea to adults. In other parts of the fair, robotic manipulators picked apples from vines, while others tossed ping pong balls and provided back massages to visitors. As part of the World Robotics Conference, forums are traditionally held with participation from both Chinese and international industry experts, offering attendees the chance to engage in live discussions and get answers to their questions. For the first time since the start of the pandemic, this year's conference and exhibition are being held in a full-fledged offline format with foreign participants. According to official information from the organizers, almost 812,000 people are expected to visit the exhibition. China is an obvious choice for hosting one of the world's largest robotics expos, not only due to its high level of technological innovation. One of the goals of the Chinese leader is to move the country's extensive manufacturing sector from producing inexpensive goods to more high-tech manufacturing, and industrial robots will become an important element of this plan. According to a 2022 report, an increasing number of factories in China are using robots on assembly lines to replace high-wage workers. Leading Chinese artificial intelligence expert Kai Fu Li had previously predicted that by the mid-2030s, technology will take over half of all jobs. He noted that certain sectors of employment are experiencing a crisis similar to the one faced by farmers during the Industrial Revolution. In 2022, a total of 517,000 robots were sold worldwide, with 268,000 of them in China. Every second industrial robot is sold for tasks in Chinese manufacturing. Additionally, domestic robot production is actively expanding. According to an official representative of the Ministry of Industry and Information Technology, the revenue from the robotics industry nationwide exceeded 170 billion yuan, $23.3 billion in 2022. This sustained growth has positioned China as a major player in global robotics production. Write in the comments which of the robots at the exhibition impressed you the most. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like it and subscribe to the Kara Show channel. Also, check out our previous videos. See you later.